Hey, what is up guys? This is Kamara coming to you with another Toonly video. Well, this video is my actual first Toonly explainer video. My Toonly infographics video. So right now guys, what I'm gonna actually do is I'm gonna show you how you can actually import any video into Toonly. Any video you want, you can use it as your background. You can use the video as a template for something. You could use it in an explainer as a normal video, as an item, like as an object. You could use the video to do anything that you want. Remember to hit that subscribe button, guys. Like, comment, and share. You know, guys, check out my other content when they come out. And I'm going to try and upload something like this twice per week. So remember to subscribe and keep those comments coming in, those likes coming in. So I know that this content is working. I can continue creating awesome videos for you guys. All right, so firstly, what we're going to do, as you can see, I have Toonly open right here. You know, you're going to need the software. So download the Toonly software, try and get, uh, well, either version, any version that you would like to get, any version that suits you, you know, you get it and so on. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go online. Just find a video that you would want to add to Toonly. Anywhere you want to get the video from, probably it's from YouTube, anywhere that you want to get the video from, you get me? So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to download the video. You can use the internet download manager and download the video. Sometimes you just have a download link. So get the video, download it. Okay, so start downloading. Yeah. All right, so that video is downloading now. So you're going to go to a site. I use easygif.com. What I do is I transfer or change that mp4 file format because it's in mp4 file format i change it to actual gif format so i have a folder that i have with all the things that i need so i just download sparkles so i put it here i upload the video here get me you can also paste in the url here but anyways so i'm going to upload the video now it's going to take a time for me to upload it. As you can see, the upload percentage was down here. And looks like it's at. So it's going to take a time to actually download. The bigger the file, the longer it's going to take. But this one shouldn't take all that long. It's actually finished now. So you have the video right here. This is the video that we're going to actually put in. As you can see, it's 17 seconds long. Is, guys so it doesn't really have any sound but you can get sounds with that i'll do another tutorial and show you how you can actually get the sound but first let's just get the videos first so that's it as you can see yeah so what i do is i convert it to GIF here i wait on it to convert shouldn't take that long once again it's the same procedure the bigger the file is the longer it's going to actually take to convert this file isn't very big so it shouldn't take that long as you can see the cat is moving and showing us the, well it's not showing us the progress but it's finished right now as i said it wasn't very big so i save the project now there it is downloading easygif.com video 45 you get me it's around 18 gig, 18 megabytes large so what i do now is you should already have your tool you open up if you want to put it as a background you can put it as a background upload new project new object as a background what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload it as an object. So I go here. I see it in my downloads. It's right in my downloads. Here it is. Around 19 megabytes. Save and upload. It is your 45. So here it is. It's uploading. It's taking a while to upload again. You know, guys. Remember to hit that subscribe button. Like, comment. And, I'll, and as always, guys, share the video. Try and share the video. You get me? So... This is taking a while for it to actually upload, so we are going to actually upload it in the background where we go and do something else, or we can actually hit save and upload, you get me? It's going to continuously upload regardless, so you can actually stay on the screen and wait till it actually finishes uploading, guys. Tune is a very awesome um, tutorial material it is a very awesome software that you can actually use for tutorials it is incredible all 
all right guys so we're back what we just uploaded was easy gift 45 video to 45 so here it is it's an object so i uploaded it and here it is you know it's but it's around 17 seconds if i recall yeah so you're just gonna wait right here until the custom object because it's a custom object that we uploaded you have normal objects in tony then you have the custom ones that we upload ourselves you get me remember to hit that subscribe button like comment and share the video guys so we're just gonna wait until it processes here over here and it actually processes here then we'll actually be able to view it play through and see how it's actually going you get me gonna show you that this is the video that we just got offline this is this can work on any video remember the remember copyright and so on though guys so let me show you here it is just as we saw it online here it is inside the Tony software and we can use it in any way we want so you can also edit this now guys you can put it in as coming in instant or it can also fade out you get me so there's some of the settings that you could do you could flip it turn it the other way you could put it to foreground or background you can also make it move inside Tony too so say for instance it started off there you're gonna make it smaller and go over there by the time it reaches there you get me so look at this now see it's getting smaller and actually moving you could use that for motion graphics or something like that guys so there you have it that's how you get any video to be able to use inside tony thank you guys if you like this video and would like to see more please like comment leave a leave and share the video leave a comment below let me know what you think inside the tony group as well too guys so thank you for your support and i'll see you soon